Hey everyone, if you've been skipping videos and still can't download Photoshop beta, that's the problem. But don't worry, I've got you covered. In this video, I'll show you the exact steps to download it properly. But listen carefully, if you skip even a single second of this video, it won't work. So stay till the end and let's get started. The first step is to create a new Gmail account. To do this, open Google Chrome and navigate to the Gmail signup page. From there, click on Create Account and follow the on-screen instructions to set up your new email. This step is essential, so make sure to complete it properly before moving forward. Step number two is to accessing Adobe Creative Cloud. Once the Gmail account is created, open a new tab in Google Chrome and search for Adobe Creative All Apps. Click on the first link in the search results. Wait for the page to fully load, then click on Sign In at the top right corner. Here, click on Create an Account, then enter the email address that we just created. Now we have entered to the main stage of this process. You can enter any first and last name of your choice, but two things are crucial. First, you must be 18 years or older, and second, for the country region, select United States, because this country is eligible for this subscription. After clicking Next, scroll down through the available options, locate Adobe Photoshop, and then click on Free Trial to proceed. The key step here is to select the Team option. Scroll down slightly and click on Continue to proceed. Fill in the first two fields as provided. In the State Province drop-down menu, select Arizona. For the zip code field, open a new tab, search for Arizona zip code, copy any valid code and paste it into the field. For the business phone field, open a new tab and search for USA temporary number. Open the first link from the search results, wait for the page to fully load, then select United States from the options. Here, scroll down slightly and copy any valid number from the list. Go to the main page and paste it over there. After that hit, continue to proceed. At this stage, download Adobe Creative Cloud. Since I already have it installed, I will open it directly on my PC. After downloading and opening Adobe Creative Cloud, enter the email address we just created on the Adobe website. Once the loading is complete, I will click on the Apps tab. Here you can install any software completely for free. Now I will go to the Beta Apps tab, where you can install the latest versions of beta software. For now, I will simply click on Photoshop to begin the installation. The installation is now complete. Simply click on the Open button to launch Photoshop. Now let's check if the Generative Fill option is enabled. Open any picture from your computer. Choose any selection tool and create a selection around the bike. After that, click on Generative Fill and type Remove Bike. The bike has been removed. You can check the other three variations if you want. Wait for a moment. If this tutorial helped you, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel.